Hello, hello, hello everybody and welcome back to Mechanical Mastery. So, I fixed our problem uh, with the uh, doubling down. I, I think it was just related to the pattern providers being the uh, blocks rather than these little injector ones. Um, that's very loud. What's making that noise? Sawmill? I don't know what's making that noise to be fair. Slowly I'm just going to mute this game more and more, aren't I? So let's maybe just um, just bring that down to 20. There we go. Uh, it's still very loud in my ear, but that's fine. Um, yeah, so I, I switched it to these. So now you'll see it's uh, Certus, Dust. So if we do this, uh, Certus, and we say craft me 10. And then we can come here and 10 are done. Perfect. So then I did build the the chandelier which uses all 32 channels um i've surrounded it in some dense energy cells just because flex i could um and it felt useful i filled it all with acceleration cards um so yeah it's it's pretty good now um and doing so i have gone through and kind of filled it out a fair bit already um and then while i was uh, faffing around, we had a problem with... Oh, it's gone now. Oh, I, I did too much. Oh, no. We had a problem with power, basically. Power wasn't going in or out fast enough with the amount of stuff we had running and having to power all of this and all of these things and stuff. So I went and built one of these, which is a uh, induction matrix. So I did leave specifically two pieces off because I wanted to explain why I kind of did this off camera because it did take a long time. Um, uh, ultimate. Ultimate. Um, so I've already got three of these induction providers in there and then three of these induction cells. So if I try and craft one of these, because we only need one more of each, you'll see it needs 500 infused of these, 16 of these, needs to craft all of this stuff. Um, and it's quite a lot to do on camera. So doing these automatically for one is the best thing in the world um, because it just comes down here and all of this kicks in and starts running and crafting. But there was one thing I needed to make before we were able to, um, before we were able to actually craft these, which was uh, lithium dust. So I did go ahead and just do this because it's quite a simple thing to do. Um, it's literally just two of these big thermal evaporators, one pumping water in, making brine. I have a um, resistive heater here, taking 10k uh, FE a tick um, to heat these both up. Uh, and then the brine comes in, it gets turned into liquid lithium. Liquid lithium comes out, it gets condensated into lithium, and then that gets crystallized into dust. And I've got two crystallizers because we make quite a bit of it. Um, so quite, it sounds complicated when you explain it, but it's quite simple. Um, and that should be, oh, they're not done yet. See, it does take a while. It, I had to wait a fair bit of time to get all three produced. Um, so while that was happening, I did also upgrade our storage cells because now we can auto craft um, like 64k I just decided I may as well give us the 256k as well um, and doing so I made a fair few and upgraded these so they now are the 256k crafters so it just means our crafting goes a little bit quicker and it makes life a little bit easier um, but this episode we're going to focus on this stuff over here. Um, I already got a rough idea of what we're doing. That's the frame of the uh, fission reactor, fusion reactor. I don't know fully what we're making. Um, so there's one of our providers. So you can see here now we've already stored 7.29 billion. We have about 180k going in and we're using about maximum of 70k a tick. So we're getting 110 as like bonus basically. Once this other one's done, I'll break this open. It is literally though induction casings, induction ports, and then these cells on the inside. It's not too much. I do wish I could see the crafting going on. It's a little annoying. I think I can, this one, yeah. There you go, and done. 
um, but I don't have a crafting like monitor, so to speak. So then we can come over here and we can break these two, and I left perfect little holes, so we need this. And the nice thing is I can destroy our power there, and our AE system will keep running for a fair bit because of all the batteries. And now it's back up and running, and we're now inputting 200,000. So now, actually, you can see the lava generators again are kicking in and doing a pitiful 5,000. The f These are the most pointless thing in the world now. Um, but I can walk on them, so cool, I guess. I don't know. Um, but yeah, so we've got our energy going in. And I do have room for this big blow of energy as well. Um, which will be the thing that basically starts to fill this at a, a much more rapid speed. Um, and I think that's all I kind of did in the interim. I kind of just went around and um, automated some stuff, really. That was the main thing that I did, but a lot of it's kind of already done. Um, but I just wanted to make sure that we could have auto crafting sort of up and running. Like you can see now we're using 25, 32, 9, and 24. Um, so we're using a lot of channels. And I made a couple more of these just for looks. Um, so yeah, we're, we're definitely... We're definitely in the the age of speed now. Uh, we only had one problem off camera, which was these actually ran out, which meant that this couldn't run, which meant the whole thing was broken. Um, but now we're we're good again, and we're starting to back stuff because I realised if this does happen again, we I know what that noise is as well now. It's bloody Windows trying to tell me like, oh, you you've got achievements and stuff. Um, but this is now running as fast as it can. I actually had to give it a Mark Four just so it could take these quick enough, otherwise it was backstuffing. But yes, so today what we need to do is we need to do this. So we need to make one of these, we need to make two of these, uh, we need to make three of these, uh, one of these, one of these, these, one of these and one of these so it's one two three okay that's fine we can we can make this work um so first off we want one isotropic centrifuge and i did um put things on autocraft to make things a bit easier one of you so then we want two rotary two of you I've never done this process, so I'm not entirely sure what we're doing. Um, oh, wait. 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 Uh, wait. Don't think that's correct. One of you, two chemical oxidizers, three chemical infusers. My bad. Um, two chemical oxidizers. Uh, we're missing personal barrel. Oh, uh, that would be because... Um, chemical oxidizers. That would be because when we programmed this, we didn't allow substitutions. Now, if I put you back in here, we should now be able to request two of you, and it will do instead a personal chest, which I have put in here. Um, so two of those, three infusers, three of you guys, start, we'll take you two, um, take you, uh, then we want a chemical dissolution chamber, oh we've got the three of these, perfect, uh, there we go, uh, we need a Disillusion chamber, uh, but we can control click and it will craft those extra bits for us. Honestly, being able to auto craft, beautiful in this game. Uh, an enrichment chamber, no problemo. Uh, oh, honestly, it does make life ten times easier. Uh, then we want the rotary, which I think we've already done this one, right? Oh, wait, what? Am I spelling this wrong? Oh, rote. Yeah, we've got one of you. I think we needed two technically, but that, uh, one, 
and then the electrolytic separator. So separator. Um, we didn't actually autograph a lot of this apparently. That's fine though. Uh, is it fine? Probably not. Uh, then that. Then that. And done. Should have completed the quest, right? Three chemical infusers. How many have we got? Oh. Um, did we make the wrong things? Chemical oxidizers. Chemi. Chem. Chemical infusers. Oh, we need three of these. Do we not have that on the list? Oh, we don't. Okay. That's a bit annoying. This is just going to be easier just to do this, isn't it? One, two, three, four. Chemical infusers. One, two. I need one more. Come on. Come on. There we go. Um, so we have now finished this. And we get these things well, regular. Like we need 20k. I need the big boys now. Um, so we do have now all of these, so let's get rid of them all for a second, and we're looking to make uh, fissile fuel, basically. This is what goes into the reactor. So that is in an itrosopic... Ugh. Well, let's wait. Let's do fissile fuel in one of these is made with this. This is made in a... Well, I guess it wants us to do chemical infuser with this and this. Um, so let's let's maybe go over here and start looking at placing things down. Uh, do we have cables on us? We do. Cool. Uh, we don't have a flux point, but we can get one. Flux point. Uh, power. Yeah, that should be right. Yeah. Um, so let's fly over here to where we're going to make this. And let's try and make this as clean as possible. So the output is going to be this, because this is what is going to make... Um, is that out then? Does it take power from... Oh, okay, it does. Right, that's fine. Um, right. So that needs to then receive from a chemical infuser, which needs access to two sides of it. Um, maybe cabling under the floor makes more sense then which is going to really annoy me because we're going to want cobble connecting cobble because I have not uh, double widened this underneath uh, wand give me both of these and let's see how much we can do one, there you go, that's one broken, that's fine. That looks pretty good to me. Um, we're not, I'm not caring too much for going past that point, so let's just clean this up, basically, and that will give us a better look. Again, trying to care a little bit more for aesthetics while I'm building things now, because I don't want to have to move my base again, because that was effort. That took so much off-screen time. Um, so let's, yeah, let's keep you here still. And let's, oh, that's pressurized tube. Uh, do not want, want this instead. Uh, wrench, there we go. Uh, universal cable, cool. Let's then run a little bit of a, a thing across here. And then bingo bang. Ooh. That'll do for now and just get rid of you. Um, so then this needs to be like this with, we're gonna need a piece here 
and a piece here, I guess. Um, right. And to make this, it's a chemical oxidizer. Chemical oxidizer, got it. Like. Uh, why did you place like that? Okay, sure. Uh, and this is a chemical dissolution chamber. Got it. Uh, chemical dissolution chamber. And then recipe for this is um, hexafluoride in a chemical dissolution chamber. So in this, with this, uh, I think that's how I've been doing it, right? Uh, recipe chemical infuser with, I think we built this wrong. Let's maybe, let's do this and let's build it in the center because otherwise I think we're gonna need to at least work out what we're doing first and then we can work on compacting. Cause I don't think it makes much sense the other way around. Um, there we go. Um, okay, let's just build this in the center for now. Uh, so let's just again tear out a couple blocks. We know we don't need to go as far anymore because it's a little bit confusing uh, Got it. Okay, so Isotropic centrifuge. This is going to output this way Into this is the chemical infuser. Yeah, 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 yeah. Chemical infuser. The chemical infuser gets a chemical oxidizer, right? To make this. Yes Chemical oxidizer goes here. No problem. Uh, bam. Then on this side, we want another, uh, I believe it was chemical, oh no, the dissolution chamber. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like so. Um, and then into this, sorry, wait. Uh, recipe for this, yeah, is a chemical infuser with sulfur trioxide and water vapor. Okay. So we need to do um, bingo, bango. So chemical infuser, like so, with then sulfur trioxide, which comes from another chemical infuser, um, which we'll put on this side. Um, oh my God, Christ. Um, with oxygen and sulfur dioxide. Sulfur dioxide comes from sulfur in a chemical oxidizer. Got it, okay. So chemical oxidizer uh, here. No, 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 sir. Here. Where's the rotate? Okay. Like that, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, trioxide comes from sulfur dioxide. Wait, I'm confused now. Sulfur trioxide comes from sulfur dioxide and oxygen. Yeah? So oxygen comes from a electrolytic separator. Is that one of the things it made me make? Yes. So then we put this here and then this side is going to make the water vapor, which comes from rotary deconcentrator of any water. So rotary deconcentrator of any water. Um, I don't know, bloody hell. How do you rotate? Is that what we want? Sure, I don't know. Um, actually, to be fair, if we rotate it, placement becomes confusing, doesn't it? Um, Right? Because I don't know why I put that marked. Fissile fuel is uranium. Oh, shit. Uranium hexafluoride in one of these. Yeah, that's fine. Um, with. So to get uranium hexafluoride, you need uranium oxide, which is yellow caved uranium. Sure. Done. Well, wait. Wait a second. How do we get that? Enrichment chamber, uranium. We didn't put that down. Um, enrichment chamber, uranium. 
right. Um, is this it? I don't know. It doesn't feel right, does it? Um, did we need metallurgic infusers at all? Uh, no, not a single one. <laughs> How have we ended up with three? Um, okay, so we need a fair few upgrades. So let's get the upgrades first. How many do we need? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eighty of each. Got it. That's fine. So uh, mech. Uh, so let's make. Let's just make eighty of each. It's going to be the easier way to do it, I think. <laughs> it's the lavish way. That's how you do it. Eighty of you. Bang. And then energy upgrades. Eighty of you. Bang feel so powerful with this much this much money to hand okay so we're going to check the upgrades in um, this we're going to need some infinite water as well that is a thing we're going to need um, definitely need the energy upgrades because I think this is quite a power intensive process um, okay can I have this actually on my hotbar um, there we go Uh, so, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, e, then, nine, ten. Uh, so then we need some more of these boys, the energy ones, and that I think should be enough because we've already put in here. There we go. Oh no. Uh, here, oh, no, uh, here, 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 and here. Okay. So this is, this is how it has to be, basically. These are the machines we use. Um, I presume I can confirm that by saying it's one, two, three, four, seven, eight, nine, ten. So ten machines. So we've got them all here. We've got them all down. This is how it expects us to do it. Um, we're going to need a tank. Uh, let's craft a, a ultimate one, sure. Uh, and we're going to need a Evertide. Ever? Yeah, Evertide amulet. Uh, which needs us to have water, which we have in the system. Do we not have any buckets in the system? That's why. Um, if you have buckets in the system, I'll show you what you can do. Water, you can just click it, and it'll give you one of your buckets full of that liquid, which is a very handy thing, um, especially for crafting these. Um, so that's fine. So, I think laser IO is the way to go for this. Uh, so let's craft 30 of you. Uh, let's also do at laser. We've got 48 of you, that's fine. We've got a load of you, that's fine. Um, how many cards do we have, actually? That's a good question. Oh, uh, plenty. Maybe some more water cards, though. Let's get 20 of you. Um, do we need any other cards? No, that should be fine. Uh, so we should be able to grab you and grab you. Perfect. Um, so just for test purposes, we need to make sure that there is power to all of this and we need to go through one by one and kind of organize this. Um, so I did this, uh, which has got sulfur, uranium and fluorite in, which we know we'll need. So let's move you over to here. Yeah, it seems reasonable. Uh, what have I just put down? Pressurized tube, of course I have. Because uh, I'm a big idiot. Uh, there. Ding. Uh, and we want these. So we want to say there. And I think I already powered this, but let's just make sure. Let's just, just open this up. Screw it. Let's go all the way around so we know what we're doing. Okay. So once I have a, a base understanding of it, we can then start to um, go from there. 
let's also take you off of the line for a second because I actually don't want to currently make any fissile fuel because I will cause a radioactive disaster. Um, so, uh, initially we want to say down. We need this to be extract. 64 at a time. And let's let's be very clear here with what we're doing. Uranium. Okay. And that will come into here. And let's just clear all sides for a second and input on the top. Uh, power, 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 power. Just charge all of you guys up. Uh, you can't take any other upgrades other than the muffling upgrade. That's fine. So don't know why I still have this in my hand. So then you, sir, will get this, which will be down, insert, but we should be a little bit clearer on this, uh, down, is there a, yeah, green, channel 5, down, insert, on, green, cool. So then if I link you guys, we should be able to go bing to bing. So you're now making this, oh, you're making it a little bit slow, aren't you? Oh, we can factory upgrade some of you guys though, can't we? Yeah, that is a good point. Um, we will tier upgrade you guys later though. Um, so then you're supposed to output items, auto eject on. You then, oh no, 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 we need to make sure that you are clear, clear, and clear. So items, input from this side. Sorry, how are you running out of power? Why don't you accept power, my friend? That is most peculiar. Where do you take power from? Huh? What are you, chemical oxidizer? Why won't you accept power? Um, do you accept it from that side? In which case, wait. Uh, wrench, rotate. Why won't you rotate? Uh, yeah. 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 You take power from no sides. Just FYI. You're a bit dumb for that. How do you receive power, sir? I break you? Chemical oxidizer. Where do you... Universal cable. What? Why don't you want to take power? That makes no sense, right? Oh, no, 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 no. Just break this. Now we should be able to vein mine, right? Yeah. Um, you definitely should accept power. Um, one second. I'm confused, confuzzled, why you haven't accepted power anywhere. We're making another one. We're going to see if we can fix it. Chemical oxidizer, quick and easy craft, and take you, break you, place you. Aha! Aha! You have power from the bottom as well? Yeah, from all sides. Okay, weird, that's fine. We will deal with this one the only way I know how. And away! And we need the upgrades again. Uh, that's fine. I've taken to just throwing things off the edge, no matter its value. Um, <laughs> because I could probably make it quicker than I need to. Okay, so now we're saying on the back, uh, one second, gases, and then energy. Oh, wait. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Do you reckon it's down there? Do you reckon it fell on this platform? I don't think it did. <laughs> nope. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so that was our fault. I disabled power into all sides, I think. Okay, well... <laughs> You learn something new, and I learn I'm a big old dummy. Um, but that's fine. We knew that from the beginning. Okay. Anyway, back to what we were doing. 
So then we say on the back, uh, you input. Uh, do I have to rotate you? Let's um, let's put you how you liked to be put last time. Oh, uh, you liked that, didn't you? So let's say wait. In that case, we say no. We say input this side. Items config input. Why are you not output auto eject? Ugh, honestly, why? That is the side, isn't it? What if I just... Oh. Okay. Why does it think that that face is the front? Oh, I'm not going to question it. It's fine. Um, so then you, which way is your front then? This way? You on this side, input, yeah. So then you, gases, uh, output, output, okay. Right, that's fine. Not entirely sure how the left is this, but sure. Um, so you now have uranium hexafluoride. Cool. Um, ooh, we are going to cause a nuclear disaster, aren't we? Because the moment I connect anything to this, we need to turn you off for a second. Okay. Then on this side, right, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. So then this needs to make for us, uh, this, yeah, 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 yeah. So this needs to have the fluorite blocks in it, sure. So we need to say here, you need to connect to you and you need to be on the down. Yeah, cool, so down, this one. We'll do white for fluorides, so that's fine. So down uh, extract one of these, and we need to say, oh, bad at finding this block every time for some reason. F L U fluorite uh, down extract U. Uh, we want to also give you these and just say bosh, and then down insert U cool. So now you have the fluorite in you. So then the fluorite needs the um, the sulfuric acid, which comes from water vapor, which is just deconcentrating water. So rotary deconcentrator. So then we just chuck you here with you, and we say empty, because that can never empty. And then you on, uh, so items none, gases none, fluids, input, uh, input. Uh, you guys don't have power over here either, do you? Uh, one second, we can fix this. Okay. Um, do, do we want it to be deconcentrating, yeah, okay. Um, what we could do, just to make things a little bit easier, is wait a second. We want, is it pressurized? Mechanical pipes, there we go, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's just do this. And let's just chuck you here, and chuck you here. You're still set correctly, then Pull you out. Okay, yeah. So you've made water vapor, and now we want to say, it is water vapor a gas? Output. It bloody is. That's fine. Um, you on your 
gases will uh, input red. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Then input yellow. Then output blue to here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So then we need to make sulfur trioxide, which is in this one. And to make that, we need sulfur dioxide, which is the chemical oxidizer with the sulfur dust. Okay, so that's easy again. So that's just U. And then we say connect to U. And then we say on the down, you're going to extract on like a yellowish channel. That'll do. Uh, with sulfur sulfur dust sure thing and then you are going to down insert on a yellowish channel uh, items input on the top is it because I've done it with a different yeah it is there we go uh, oh yeah you are working oh we just need to now down set you to a full stack every tick Perfect. Um, and you need two item config input on the top. That's it. Gases. You need to output from the front. Auto eject. From the left. From the right. Wait a second. Yeah, that should work either way. Um, from the back, from the bottom, from the front, oh, this is items, front, no, left, very confusing machines, <laughs> but that's fine. Uh, and then all we need is water vapor, which comes from deconcentrating. No, 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 wait. This one, which needs oxygen. Yeah, 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 yeah. Which this just needs to electrically separate. Um, so let's, before we mess things up, because I've done it before, let's just leave energy. Uh, so fluids, we're going to give it his own fluid or should I for the sake of being a cool guy do this and say uh, U to you on the down you're going to extract water at a alarming rate um, and then down insert water you need to then accept fluids from the top. There we go. And now we need oxygen, which is the light blue, to go uh, gases. Yeah, okay. And then we just need to dump excess. And now that is creating sulfur trioxide. Um, then you need to output to the back. We're getting there, we're getting there. Um, output to the back, which makes sulfuric acid, which makes this, which makes this, and that is how it is supposed to be built. Okay, we now understand the build process, um, but this episode's running on quite long, so what I'm going to do is try and squeeze this as much as possible and twist it, because I don't like it where it is. <laughs> Okay, so thank you very much for watching guys, and I will see you in the next one. Oh wow, you've actually made it this far. Okay, um, three things. Um, don't forget to maybe watch another video, I don't know which side I'm on. These ones, this or this, there's a box with a video. Um, consider subscribing and maybe like the video. Leave a comment, I'll, I'll say hello. Anything. Go, go wild. <laughs>